All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel, man. Today we have an Isaiah Thomas possibly going to the Los Angeles Lakers video. Last night in the G League, he continued to go off, dropped 46 points, 7 assists, 5 rebounds, 9 three-pointers, and shot 52% from the field. So this is something Isaiah's been doing for a little bit now. Uh, he's actually played about five games so far in this season in the NBA. He did not do very well, but... I'm looking at a team like the Lakers, um, you know, there's a couple of other teams, contending teams 100% that I think could use Isaiah Thomas's services. We'll talk about his impact on the Lakers here in just a second, but so far in this season, in those five games, only 8.6 points, about two assists, shooting 32% from the field, 20% from downtown, so he just did not last very well in the nba this season now i believe fully if you give isaiah thomas kind of the opportunity to work freely where the ball is in his hands majority of the time aka if the lakers were to sign him put him on the bench i think he would actually do exactly what he did over in boston i mean keep in mind this is a career 18 and 5 player Boston peak Isaiah Thomas when he was like 26 27 years old uh, he dropped 29 points per game on six assists as well shot 38% from downtown this is just I guess it's like a whole six years ago but I mean this was a crazy time period this was a really crazy time period Isaiah Thomas literally dropped 29 points a game in an NBA season and if you watch the film, if you go back, you watch the couple of games he's played in the G League this week specifically where he's dropping 40-point game after 40-point game, He's. it's not like he's slower. It's also not like he's made drastic improvements. Like, he's just the same dude. Like, he's literally just the same dude. Like, he hasn't lost his step. He's not, like, getting fatigued out here. He's not also, like, huge. He's not jacked. I mean, he's still 5'9". It, it's not like he's in extremely good shape. He's the same dude. This is literally the same dude, but he's just in the G League right now. So, Isaiah Thomas, what would his impact on the Lakers be? Well, obviously, there's a lot of defensive concern. A lot of defensive concern. Uh, by the way, if you guys are new here, be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button for daily NBA and Lakers content. But the Lakers right now, 27-32. and 32. They only have a two-and-a-half game lead ahead of the Portland Trailblazers. Clippers, they've won two straight games. They're not, like, getting farther away, but two-and-a-half game lead over for the Lakers. So the Lake Show right now, you're looking at the ninth seed. And while I admit... The Lakers do need defense. Um, the buyout market this season has been extremely quiet. Extremely quiet. I feel like a guy like Tomas Sadoransky would have actually been super useful for the Lakers. But unless LA is taking an initiative and they're the team being like, let's go try and get these guys. Like, Sadoransky got bought out immediately went to Washington. Immediately went, immediately went back to Washington. So... There's a lot of competition as well. You got to keep that in mind. So LA, as far as the buyout market goes, I mean, it's over in two days. It's literally over in two days. It's over on Tuesday. So I was thinking there was going to be a lot more moves. I was thinking that guys like Eric Bledsoe, Gary Harris, I thought they would all be available, but that's not, that hasn't been the case. That hasn't been the case. So IT, I think he would come onto the Lakers bench and just provide them what they've so desperately been lacking any type of bench scoring outside of Carmelo Anthony and Melo obviously he's back now but he was gone for a whole month and that Lakers bench was just catastrophic you still don't have Kendrick Nunn I still can't believe Kendrick Nunn has not played this entire season it's just so confusing IT why not take the risk you're the ninth seed in the playoffs like why not take the risk so that's it for today drop a comment down below if you want the lakers to go ahead and make a move for isaiah thomas as always like button 